Fine, you're in the red. What you want? What's up? What's up? I'll tell you what's up. My ego had to complete in the gauntlet last time. But you used giant players to complete it, so can you really count that? Wait a second, are you really questioning me right now? How about you come back whenever you complete the gauntlet yourself and then you can talk? I mean, I already did. Okay, well, nobody asked you. But you just did, though. Next question. Why do you continue to play Madden whenever we all know you're so terrible at it? We'll 1v1 one day, maybe that'll answer that question for you. Hey, it's over here, over here! Whoa, okay, everybody chill, one at a time. How about you? Rumor has it you got catfished last week by a 40-year-old man. Would you like to speculate on that? Why does this always have to get brought up? You know what, I'm ending the interview again. What's going on? What's going on? I can't be doing this. I'm right here, boys. Everybody slow your roll. What's going on, guys? I'm your boy, Pete, and welcome to the Madden 18 Gauntlet. Last time, we brought 99 Giants in there, we, and we rocked and rolled with them, and it went pretty good. I don't know if you could call it a challenge whenever it actually gets easier, but today is definitely a challenge, though. Now, pay attention. Last time, I searched for forever to try to find us a roster to find Giant players. This time, fortunately for me, it wasn't too bad. Now, if this can ever load... Two hours later. What's going on? Okay, there we go. Now I want to have a huge thank you to the man that made this roster. I went through it, he made things legit, and I wouldn't be able to do it if it wasn't for him. So again, thanks, bro. Now for this roster, we actually had a couple different options. Do we go with the all 99 team? Do we go with really terrible people? Or do we do what, what I think is the best idea and go with a standard team? Now you can see all of these guys are five foot five. They're small as heck. They're all really short. Maybe some are fat like this guy. What's that supposed to mean, huh? What do you mean, bro? You're 335 pounds and you're five foot five. You need to lose some weight or something. But this roster here, like I said, has all the small players that we're looking for, but they have realistic overalls. So we're we're gonna be able to really see what the difference is of going in with a bunch of short guys. But every person from the quarterback to the team's punter, every person, small. 5-5. Five, five. Huge disadvantage. Let's go ahead into the skills trainer now and see what team first off. We're going up against the Steelers. They're going to make me go up against my home team. We have no other choice but the 13 overall Jets. Now before we get into the gauntlet run with the tiny players, on our last gauntlet video, you guys smashed it. I asked for 7,000 likes and you nearly doubled that. We had 13 or 14,000 on that video and I ain't expecting to get that. Don't get me wrong. But again, for all of you gauntlet fans that have been watching the gauntlet from who knows how far back drop a like on the video right now if we could just somehow try to hit that 7,000 like mark again it would be so dope with that said though let's go ahead and get into this well, it says our high score is 37. That's fake. We made it into the 50s at least with a bunch of these different teams Whoa, what? Again, just one more reason on why I stopped playing the gauntlet. Just super broken right now. And cooling this, look, no stamina. I can literally loop circles left and right, and it's like nothing even happened. But instead of wasting everybody's time, we'll keep on going, and we'll pick it up for you. You can thank me later. Oh, what, 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 what? Base drop! Already an extra life challenge. We just need to get through the hot spot with our running back. I really don't know names right now, but I hope that they can hold a block. You know what? They did that better than the Giants did last time. I'm pretty sure that, that was one that we failed on. Ooh, the high point pass. Okay, this is one. If he throws it too high, which I feel like is definitely a possibility, he could sky it over his head. That didn't happen, though. We got good accuracy on that quarterback. Good hands on our receiver. And another challenge that could give us problems. We need to get past the center by doing one of these swim moves and tackle Le'Veon Bell, which we do. Now, we still have way on our players. You know our defensive tackle probably weighs nearly 300 pounds. Here we go with our running back. We have enough wheels to get past Mike Mitchell off the Pittsburgh Steelers now, which to be real, I'm not too mad about. He was uh, a big talker, a big hitter here and there, but dang, did that guy give up some big plays. Now enough about them. Let's keep on moving with this New York Jets offense. As of right now, it seems like we haven't had much of a problem with our defense or our offense for that matter. Even though these guys are tiny, they have not given us any problems. And this guy's going to be open. Not sure if he's our tight end. Almost thought that he dropped it right there and then ladder challenge now, okay? Some really big guys going up against our tiny running back. Number 24 for us has been very, very good. Let's keep on... 
I knew right away I messed that up. That was pathetic, actually. Oh, that was one of the ones that actually moved us back a couple levels, I believe. We didn't lose a life, which is okay. Just need to bring down Le'Veon Bell again. And if I have redemption on that ladder level, you can count on me that we're going to make it. What is our wide receiver's name? Juan Dito or something? What the heck is that? I, I'm not even gonna ask questions. Back at it, level 10, boss bodyguards coming at you. The strategy for this one, I know it's been a while. Let the computer get the first guy, computer get the second guy. Okay, why are we running so slow, boss? Back to six chances now. It's like we never got that extra life level. Come on, get a block. We have a one-on-one -on -one now. If you, oh, we blocked two guys. You see how we do? Because if we didn't do that, we weren't gonna complete that level. Quite nice over here on this side. Hill Cam, our quarterback. On third down and three, we hand it off to the running back. The tiny guy is getting blocks for us. For some reason, that running back keeps reminding me of Saquon Barkley. Don't ask me why, because he's like super small. Why would you say that? Like you put me in such an uncomfortable situation. Like Not allowing this offense to pick it up a first down. Oh, we need a big hit here. Oh, and Le'Veon Bell. The best back in the league isn't going anywhere. These are hit or miss for me all the time. We need to read this right. We definitely did. And our quarterback's actually a bit fast. Like I said, Mike Mitchell can lay hits. Curly now, what you got? One on four. The tiny guy. There's Cam Hayward. There's Stephon Tuitt. Number 28. I um, Is that Allen, I believe? I don't know. I gotta learn my Steelers players. But regardless, we're past that. And there it is. I told you that we're gonna be coming back for redemption. It's a seven on eight. We got super tiny guys. What are we gonna do about it? How about pass it to A, he gets the ball, we run somebody over, get truck, son! Yeah, didn't know I could do that, did ya? The hallway now reminds me of the school days. Walking up and down the halls, we have RB here. If you do the possession catch, we... I wanna leave after that because tell me I didn't get that one. Tell me I didn't get it. You don't want to because you know that we did. Now you're gonna get me hyped up. Don't do that to me because whenever we get hyped up, we normally mess things up. But not this time. We're gonna take our time like we normally do. B's chilling there. Like I said, I'm gonna take my time like I normally do. It figures as soon as he moves up on the ball, it's the time that I pass it. Let's go now. We're going for the seam. Straight to Y, please. He still got it somehow. Don't ask me how, but he did. Now another one, which could be very problematic and I mean, never mind. Pittsburgh Steelers secondary is off. There's gonna be a time limit here on this play. Can we fit this one in? No, that was actually really stupid. Coming in watching this gauntlet, you should expect me to make dumb plays like that. Let's not make a dumb decision again here. I wanna go short, don't know if it's the best idea. It definitely wasn't, because they wrapped this up. This is starting to make me feel a little bit uncomfortable now. What do we do? Oh my gosh, how do I mess this up three times? Three lives lost on this. This was like one of the best gauntlet runs I've had up to this point and I fluffed it up like by doing that. Is that an unbelievable joke or what? I could have completed that on the first try. Wow, am I upset about that one? Now boss media day, we cannot mess this one up. Like this is one where we need to just do our thing, cut in between people and get to that end zone. Dang, am I still upset though? Such an easy level and we lost about half of our lives there. This one just has to end up in the hot spot. Are you kidding? It's like the game feels a little bit bad for me because they gypped us out of like three lives there. Hey dummy, how about you stop blaming the game and admit that you are trash? Nobody asked you. We have a short guy, we have short arms, but we need to get in there quick and still go for the die. Oh, now see, now you can't tell me that if we were taller, we were gonna get that. I genuinely believe it. Okay, I'm gonna stay chill. We're gonna be quiet. We're gonna try to block this. Attempt number two. Get it. Block that kick. Let's go. We actually got it. Okay, so that didn't matter as much as I thought it was going to. Take away the receiver. We're going to be using LT here to shadow over Antonio Brown. I assume this is the only receiver that he's going to be going for. Smoke Martavius Bryant taking his time. Probably reefing over there on his way on the motion. I actually don't understand what I just watched right there. But regardless... What the heck? Okay. I don't get to call any adjustments or audibles or anything. I just don't understand. I'm gonna lose on this level right here. Please don't lose here. Like genuinely, please like block this somehow. Please, thank you, okay. I'm getting really nervous now. An extra life level would be pretty great. Oh no, this was a boss level that we did not want because being short here, going up against Martavius Bryant, Eli Rogers, Antonio Brown, 
Not exactly ideal. Oh, overthrown, and we'll take that one. So we're only a couple boss levels away from actually making it to level 40, which is sick. This is an elite option play. You already know I'm gonna fluff this one up, boys. I handed it off, I definitely messed it up. That's gonna be game over. That's so dumb, because I was gonna gain yards on it. Youch, that was tough. Completely blame that on that one level, though, where we lost three lives unnecessarily. Super disappointing, too, because to be real, I feel like being small actually might not matter. Like, we made it to, what, level 30, 31 with not much of a problem there? And there really wasn't any one specific level that gave us a ton of problems. So maybe we give this another go at another time. Let me know down below. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Supporting the gauntlet. We keep coming back with it here and there. I can never give up because this is this is my roots. This is where it all started. If you have never played the gauntlet for some reason, go into the skills trainer, try it yourself, see what level that you can get to, and put it down in the comments. Just let me know. I want to see how good you guys are at the gauntlet because I feel like I'm actually pretty decent for how much that I played or used to play it. I want to see what your scores compared to mine. The max level, level 40, but you can go beyond that. We've done it before here. Anyways, guys, I'm your boy Pizza. Thank you so much for watching, giving me some of your time today. If you're brand new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. we got some awesome stuff in Madden on the channel. If you're into Fortnite, some super sick videos, different things, you know, things that people really haven't done before in the game. Check that out on the channel. And until next time, I'm your boy Pizza. Don't forget to keep God number one, and I'll see you all next time. Peace out, guys. We're out of here.